All engineering fields are not made equal, with vastly different salaries and happiness reported from engineers. Now we've put together a single score so that you can finally compare electrical to aerospace, mechanical to mechatronics, and you wouldn't believe which field ranks number one above all of the rest. Now, if you haven't seen part one of this video, we've gathered everything from engineers reported happiness to job count to future outlook, and of course salary to rate each of these six fields with a single objective metric. Now, make sure to watch that video first. If you haven't yet, then come back to this one to see which engineering field is rated higher than all of the rest. I'm Engineer Joe. Welcome to Engineering Insiders. Now, thank you to JLCMC for sponsoring this video, but more on that later. Let's get this started off with a channel favorite, Aerospace Engineering. Now, this field isn't just about rockets, it's about plane engines too. No, but seriously, these engineers can be found doing anything from optimizing aerodynamics to refining propulsion systems, tackling challenges where even the smallest little detail can throw you right out of orbit. And it is quite the exciting field. In 2015, SpaceX reused a rocket for the first time, which was groundbreaking. And in late 2024, they just used the Mechazilla launch tower to catch the largest rocket that has ever launched. It's craziness. Companies like SpaceX are pushing the boundaries with old school defense companies like Lockheed Martin and Boeing keeping up and new startups are right around the corner, making aerospace a relatively secure career path. Now, with a projected 6% job growth over the next decade and an average US salary of 138,000 big ones, opportunities are strong. Although most roles require on-site work and could have you in the middle of nowhere, Texas. There is growing flexibility in research design and simulations, so we'll see. Factoring in all these metrics, Aerospace Engineering scores a solid 3.15 out of 5, putting it just behind Mechatronics Engineering. Okay, now some real talk. I'm actually in the aerospace field working in the Bay Area on satellites to bring internet to those who need it around the world. And I am super happy with my job and got here only because in my electrical engineering degree, JLC PCB helped me make multiple PCBs for side projects and my internship. And now JLC MC is the equivalent for mechanical parts. So if you're interested in a career in basically any of the fields on today's list, make sure to check out JLC MC for your side projects Parts. Anything from timing belts to pulley kits, linear rail and bearing systems to threaded rod assemblies. JLC has got you covered with up to $60 in free coupons and a monthly surprise coupon when you register with our link in the description below. Now, thank you a ton to JLCMC for helping keep this channel going. And if you want to show some love for this video, like, subscribe, and make sure to click that link in the description. It really means the world to us. Now, let's get back to the video. Now, what if we put down our wrenches and turned our focus on? to the body, where engineering meets medicine. We would have biomedical engineering. Now, what if I told you these engineers are helping create artificial hearts, 3D printed organs, and prosthetic limbs? I would be telling the truth. <laughs> biomedical engineers are at the front lines of blending technology with medicine to save lives and push the boundaries of what's possible in healthcare. These engineers work closely with doctors to design cutting edge medical devices, diagnostic tools, and prosthetics that improve patient outcomes and revolutionize revolutionize how we treat disease. With healthcare constantly evolving, biomedical engineering is expected to grow by 8% over the next decade, driven by the increasing demand for innovative solutions in an aging population. While this growth is steady rather than explosive, the average US salary sits at a solid $82,000 a year, making it a respectful and meaningful career choice as it does come in as the second most meaningful of all engineering career. So if you're looking to change lives and apply your engineering skills to improve human health, biomedical engineering might just be the perfect fit for you. All things considered, we found biomedical engineering to have a final worth it rating of 2.9 out of 5, placing it just barely behind mechanical engineering in today's rankings. Now up next, we have another channel favorite, my field. Electrical engineering, similar to computer engineering, is behind all of our modern technology. It spans everything from microelectronics and power generation to renewable energy systems and communication technology. Basically, if there's a circuit involved, you can bet an electrical engineer had something to do with it. But you might just say I'm biased. It is my field after all. I started with a pretty cool company, got sold to a more defense type company, and more recently took the job in the Bay Area testing radio frequency circuits on satellite systems. And trust me, the difference in job satisfaction is real. While electrical engineering has an average happiness rating compared to other fields, the career options are vast. Opportunities range from 5G networks and space communication to 
power system design and microchip fabrication. Now, with a projected 9% job growth to an already large field and average salaries exceeding $112,000, electrical engineering holds a solid rating of 2.9 out of 5 in our ranking. Very close, but right in between mechanical and biomedical, but still sort of far off from the highest ranking, coming up soon. Next, let's shift focus to a field near and dear to my heart, environmental engineering. Now, environmental isn't just about sustainability. It's about protecting our planet from serious threats. Rising global temperatures, water scarcity, and increasing air pollution aren't distant problems. They're happening now. These engineers are on the front lines, working to ensure future generations have clean air to breathe and safe water to drink. Ever hear about contaminated water in Flint, Michigan? Or maybe the record-breaking wildfires and intensifying droughts that dominate the news. It's pretty frustrating, but environmental engineers are the ones stepping in to develop real solutions, from designing advanced water filtration systems to reducing emissions and preserving ecosystems. Thanks to the growing push for green technology, the field is evolving steadily with a 7% growth rate in the US. They also have very solid salaries, averaging around $87,000 a year. This is likely due to environmental projects often relying heavily on government funding and lengthy approval processes, slowing progress, and limiting financial growth. Still, they're in the upper echelon with their meaningful rating, reflecting a passion for the meaningful work in the field. Considering all factors, this field scores a final 2.8 out of 5 in our rankings, and we'd like to say we are super thankful for all these engineers and what they do for society. If you're an environmental engineer, thank you, leave a comment, let us know you're here. Now up next, we have a bit of a pivot, industrial engineering, the career that keeps industries efficient and businesses running smoothly. This field is all about efficiency, optimizing production lines, improving supply chains, and streamlining logistics to save time, cut costs, and boost productivity. When you place an order on Amazon, you expect it at your door in a day or two, but behind that smooth process lies a complex web of logistics, robotics, and data-driven optimization, all orchestrated by some of the world's finest industrial engineers. These engineers design and optimize warehouse layouts to minimize the time it takes to pick, pack, and ship products. Product. They analyze conveyor systems and robotic automation, ensuring that packages move through fulfillment centers as efficiently as possible. By fine-tuning every step in this process, they cut costs while speeding up delivery time. That to say, without industrial engineers, next day delivery wouldn't just be impressive, it would be impossible. Now, as automation and data-driven solutions grow in importance, industrial engineering is on the rise with a 12% projected job growth over the next decade. Average salary sits at a healthy $105,000, offering pretty healthy financial incentives. However, there are higher levels of location dependence and high work stress, which can limit the happiness in the field, earning it a final rating of 2.9 out of 5, just behind biomedical and in front of chemical engineering. As you might be able to tell, we haven't highlighted the highest ranking field yet. That field starts with an S and just might be an entire career path focused on integrating and managing complex projects from start to finish. That field is systems engineering. Jobs in this field are really high-level problem-solving roles, where engineers like me design and work with circuit boards to ensure our satellite will work. Our systems engineers are making sure our circuits work with the SDR circuits, which work with the power circuits and the onboard computers, so on and so on. In other words, these engineers bring together machines, software, and processes to ensure that each individual engineering product can function smoothly as a whole. From spacecraft coordination to healthcare system optimization, system engineers keep everything running like clockwork. Their job, integrate, optimize, and manage these intricate systems while troubleshooting and improving workflows. The demand for systems engineers is booming, with 21% job growth projected over the next decade, translating into about 550,000 new positions in the US. With their salaries averaging around $111,000, it's no wonder why systems engineering ranks fifth overall in happiness. Beyond happiness, the worth it metric for systems engineers comes in at 3.2 out of 5 on our worth it scale, just behind our high ranking mechatronics and robotics. But if we want to look for our highest ranking, we'll have to look at the last field, a unique engineering field whose work benefits each of the other fields. Now make sure to stay tuned to the end to be blown away by these salaries and subscribe if you've learned anything about any of the fields so far. Thank you, we appreciate it. Now this field is at the core of today's 
today's tech revolution, applying engineering principles to design, develop, and maintain software systems that power everything from mobile apps to your favorite web services. It is the engine behind today's biggest businesses, including mine, because every successful company relies on software to stay competitive in this digital first world. Let's take Google for example. Google processes over 8.5 billion searches per day, delivering relevant results within milliseconds. But how does it all happen so fast? Well, software engineers optimize the search algorithms, filtering through not tera, not peta, but exabytes of information. Yes, I had to look that up. And continually improving AI-powered connections to make sure you get exactly what you're searching for. Without them, finding reliable information would be a chaotic guessing game. One of the biggest perks of being a software engineer? Flexibility. With just a laptop and Wi-Fi, you can work from anywhere, whether it's your couch, a coffee shop, or even a beach, if you can focus. This level of freedom is rare in other fields, and a part of why software engineers are the seventh happiest of all fields on our list. But why aren't they first? Well, they rank pretty low in meaning, which even I can understand as just working with a computer all day can be pretty isolating. Now, combine that with a 17% growth rate to an already massive industry and an average salary of $118,000, it's clear why software engineering ranks number one, earning a 3.3 out of five worth it metric. Now, thanks for waiting. Here are all of the average salaries for each of the fields, courtesy of Glassdoor. By the way, I actually can't believe aerospace is the highest. I definitely thought it was going to be software. Anyways, if you wanna hear more on any of these fields, check out our channel's deep dives. And if you wanna hear about how happy engineers are compared to other job fields, and which engineering field is the happiest, check out this video. Thanks for watching and happy engineering, everybody.